Hi everyone, this is an easy to medium difficulty question in statistics and averages. Concept tested is arithmetic mean or averages. We'll be solving this question using the standard framework that we use for any average question. It should take us about 45 seconds in the examination at most. We've also ended this question with a bonus question, which is again an easy question. Once you know how to crack this question, the bonus question should also be easy for you to do. Let's get started with this question. The average age of a group of 10 students was 20. So number of students known, their average is known. The average age increased by two years. So this 20 is going to become 22. When? When two new students join the group. We have 10 students, two new join. So total count becomes 12 after the two new students have joined. What is the average age of these two new students? The 10 becoming 12, we had two students joining. What is the average age of the two new students who joined the group? We're going to use the standard framework. Standard framework typically has three columns for us. Number in one column, average in one, and the sum in the third. We can do any addition subtraction to the sum column. We can do any addition subtraction to the number column from which we'll derive the averages column. Let's quickly fiddle in what our data we have. Initially, 10 students. Their average age was 20 years. So 10 times 20, which is equal to 200, is the sum of their ages. Two new students join. The question is asking us to find out the average age of those students. Let's assign a variable because we do not know that. Let's take it to be an A. So sum of their ages is the number times average, which is equal to 2A. Now, with the two new students joining, the overall count becomes 12. The average has gone up by a 2, so this 20 is going to become 22. Let's run through the same process. What will be the sum of the ages of all 12 students? Number times the new average. 22 times 12, 22 into 10 is 220, plus another 44. 264 is what we have. Now, this is one way to find out the sum of the ages of all 12 students. The number times the average. Another way of doing it is, hey, I know the, av the sum of the ages of 10 students in the group. I know the sum of the ages of two students in the group. So this is going to give me the sum of the ages of all 12 students. So 200 plus 2a is the sum of the ages of the initial 10 plus the two new students, which computed as a product of the new number and new average works out to 264. So 2a is equal to 64, taking this 200 to the other side. So a is equal to 32. What is a? A is the average age of the new students who join the group, which is what we needed to find out. So 32 years, choice D is the correct answer to this question. When you're doing the examination, it will take you probably even lesser. There are other ways of doing it, but this is a sure short way without even thinking too much. You can just quickly run through this question and be done with the, uh, and get the correct answer. As I promised, here's a bonus question, slight change to the wordings. The average age of group of 10 students is, was 20, no changes there. The average age increased by two years, no change there. When two students left the group, the original question had two students joining the group, here two students left the group. What is the average age of the two students who left the group? These are the five answer options. Try this and post your answers in the comment section of this video. Best wishes.